One minute. Gentlelady from Washington is recognized for one minute. Thank you, Madam Speaker. We're debating an extreme bill with no chance of becoming law when we could be weeks into conferencing a farm bill. SNAP has prevented millions from falling into poverty. In the western part of Washington State, 690,000 people are still experiencing hunger, and we should not be arbitrarily cutting off aid. This bill would force states to cut off people struggling to find a job, also stripping them of transportation and child care assistance. If states don't comply, they lose funds for the SNAP employment and training programs, like the model program we have in Washington state that has led many to self-sufficiency. Even at the height of the recession, 60% in Washington's programs found employment and more than half were off assistance two years after the program. House leadership says this bill will lead to more people working, but how does cutting programs proven to help people find jobs accomplish this? All this bill does is cut the lifeline for 3.8 million hungry American families, children, veterans, and seniors. This is not a serious proposal. I urge my colleagues to vote no, and I yield back. Gentlelady yields back. Gentleman from Oklahoma. Madam Speaker, I rise to